Hello all you beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody's having a fantastic day today. In today's video, yeah, I'm trying TikTok hacks for cats. Um, for those of you who don't know what TikTok is or assume what it is, TikTok is an app where people post all kinds of videos for entertainment purposes and learning purposes, blah, 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 blah. A lot of people think it's just people recreating dances over and over again, which a lot of it is. However, a lot of it, there's a bigger, broader side to it. Um, there's so many subsections and genres. Um, but like, for instance, I there's plant people, people who do all kinds of gardening techniques. There's people with animals, all sorts of cute animal stuff and so many kittens. Oh my gosh, can't even get in. <laughs> Um, what else? There's witch talk, there's gay talk, there's really weird parts of TikTok that you randomly get into, but either way, it's a very broad thing is what I'm getting at. Um, but yeah, there are products that I've seen come up on TikTok so that I was like, oh, this would really help me at home. So I got a few of them. We're going to try them today. And yeah, I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. So we'll go ahead and get started. So the first thing I got was for, okay. Well, little backstory. So we keep the cats separate. Princess actually hates um, dumpling and pudding. So we basically keep her in the bedroom. We do open the door so she has the option to come out, but oftentimes she just only comes out to the hallway to yell at us and then runs back. But anyway, the other two buttholes will sneak into the room and eat her very expensive food because she's on a very specific diet for her kidneys. And you know, it's like $35 for an eight pay or less than an eight pound bag of food. So, you know, it kind of sucks when these guys eat it and it's like, oh, she needs that for, like, you get it, right? So for that problem, I got this, I saw this on TikTok. I'm like, oh no, I, I have to try it. It's called the Scat. It is um high pressurized air that comes out and has this little motion sensor. It's off right now. Um, but if something walks by, it shoots out air. Um, and I actually bought this a while ago, but then I needed to buy a couple of other things for the cat, so I decided to turn in a whole video. But anyway, I'll insert me trying to put the damn thing together. Um, so I'm going to be putting this in front of our bedroom door and then leaving my camera there to see, like, if they try and come by. I might also, like, tempt them by leaving, like, food out. Um... But we'll see if that works. I mean, it, I m put my hand by it and it does shoot out. But I mean, like, if it's affected enough to, like, keep them away from the door. Because the other problem we have, too, is if we don't feed them on time every day, they start crying at the door and scratching. And I'll show you the little hole they made by the door. Uh, yeah, so it's really annoying because, you know, sometimes you just want to sleep an extra 20 minutes and they're over here dying, dying, because we do portion out their food, but we give them a good amount, so they're just pretending to die, whatever. So that is the solution to the first problem. The second problem we're having is pudding, who if you haven't seen... is very large and in charge um we know that she steals this one's food for one and then i th and some cats are just fat on top of that so that combined is just made pudding very overweight we've tried several things <clears throat> they haven't worked so i saw this on the tiki talkie oh where'd it go i also still have to buy it or open it um but I was like, maybe this is what we need, too, because the other problem they have, too, is because we're 20 minutes late feeding them, so they eat all the food and blah, 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 and then proceed to puke 10 seconds later all over the freaking carpet. So, to combat that problem of overeating too quickly, I found these. They're um, slow feeder dishes, and they look like this. And it's pretty cute, right? So yeah, you just fill it the normal amount and it's harder for them to get at and it makes them take their time. So hopefully that will, you know, help with the vomiting. And then the final product that I got 
is just more of like a comfort thing, I guess, or a cleaning thing. But I got these fancy, fancy gloves. Um, also, I'll list the price as I like show these off. But yes, fun gloves that we can probably try now. Because I'm going to have to set up the other stuff later because it's not feeding time. And I'll probably go in a little bit to check in on Princess and hang out with her for a little bit. But we can try these on Dumples now. Um, so let's see. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. So let's do that. This is weird. They already feel really weird. Oh, okay. Eh, eh, eh. Okay. You ready? <laughs> Did you see her face? She's like, what the hell, Mom? Can y'all see that? Hold on. What is it? Ooh, not bad for a few swipes. <laughs> She's like, I don't know how to feel about this. What do you think? Not bad. But she doesn't have the frayer coat. It's more um, pudding that has a heavy coat. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm gonna have to try it on the other two to see their reaction. Do you like it? I like that how one glove is just dumple size. Hello. It's very weird to pet too, I must say. <laughs> Are you seeing this? Oh, this is picking up good. Hello, do you like it or no? I think it's Dumples approved. I can't really tell, but for now, let's say she likes it. Look at all that fur I got off. I'll try pudding next and then princess. There's, I feel like it's not picking up on the camera, but it is a lot. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try this on the other cats and then I'll also show you the food or the feeding things and then give you like my opinion on that later and just see how it works. And then we'll also see the little skin uh, Cat in action, so just stay tuned for the rest. So I came to test on Princess next because Pudding wasn't having it right now. But she snored. <laughs> Princess. Princess. Hello. Hi. I, I got something I want to try on you. Is that okay? Can you see all her gray hairs? Oh, I'm so cute. Bless you. You ready? Okay, and so here you can see I'm petting down Princess. Um, she really did enjoy it. However, I think because she is a short hair, it just did not pick up a lot of her fur. Um, she doesn't have much of a coat, but that's fine because she really did enjoy just having like, you know, a little spotting, getting all the attention and pets. And I think she genuinely loved the little nubbies on it because um, later I was playing with her and rubbing her face and she was just like in heaven. So I'll definitely be using this on her in the future. Okay, so here we have Pudding. It took a little bit to wrangle her because she hates being held, as you can tell. Um, but we got a hold of her finally, and Randy started going to town. And let me tell you, these gloves do work. Look at all of that. Look at that. Like, it was just so crazy. And we got so much more than that. Um, so I would definitely recommend these. <laughs> you can see she's just not happy. But, um, yeah, look at all of that. He literally did that, I think, like four or five times after this. But 10 out of 10 would recommend these gloves to anybody. And for the price they were, I think it's a really great deal.
Okay, so on to my favorite part, the sket. <laughs> As you can see, I have it set up in front of my bedroom door, and Dumples is already curious in the background. Um, she saw me setting it up, and literally, like, after I set this down and went to the bedroom to, like, edit another video, it didn't take her very long to, like, work up the nerve to come check out what was going on, so here she comes, so unsuspecting, thinking she might get a little snack, and then... <laughs> still cracks me up you can hear me cracking up in the background but I just thought it was so funny because literally she waited like two minutes like oh yeah mom's not gonna see me and then we move on to pudding where she took a little bit longer and that's why I put the food out and I know what you're thinking like why didn't you just wait for it to happen organically like no I wanted a reaction and I wanted them to be afraid to start coming over here um and then it didn't take long after seeing the food for her to like okay I'll come check it out and see what's going on and then <laughs> her reaction was definitely my favorite, just watching her little fat booty run away, but it works, so there you go. Okay, and now on to the final product, which was the special food bowl dishes. Um, I would have to definitely say that they were a success. Um, as you can see, the cats really have to work for them, or for the food. Um, they're not eating all the food in five seconds and proceeding to throw up all over the place, so that's been nice. Um, and they're also having to pace themselves, so and then they still have food throughout the day versus like eating it in two hours and not ha and having to wait and then begging at dinner time. It's been really nice. It's been a hard adjustment period, and they've also figured out that pudding's food is a little bit easier to get to. She's on a specific diet too to kind of help with the weight, and we're hoping to see a difference within the next few weeks as far as like her weight's concerned um but yeah uh for the price of both bowls and how successful they've worked uh 10 out of 10 would recommend um and then this this funny thing just happened pudding figured out she could take food out of the dish and run away and eat it in the corner and here <laughs> sorry Okay, and that's it for the cat TikTok hacks. That was so hard for me to say. I don't know why, uh, but I really enjoyed doing those. Um, they definitely still work. It's been a few days since I filmed all that, but the bowls are still working great. The cats like the gloves now because they get a little massagey. And then the scat definitely works. I've scared myself walking past it a couple times because I'm a dumbass, but whatever. Um, and we also learned that our dear old lady baby... Well, I'll insert this clip here. Now confirm is deaf. Randy turned on the spray thingy and she walked by it, didn't hear it, and kept sniffing it and sending it off. How many times? It was like four, right? Four times. I just shut it off. Know what it was. I went over there and she was just sniffing where the sensor was. <laughs> it wasn't spraying her directly, but uh, yeah. she just didn't know what it was. Oh, our deaf baby really is deaf. Deaf. That's why I no say wonder. things on her head that was Yeah, as you can see, yeah, she's deaf. Oh, uh, definitely deaf for sure. We know that now. Um, but it's it's okay, you know, she's 19. Well, she'll be 19 next month. Oh my gosh, gotta plan her birthday. <gasps> Almost forgot. New video coming out for that. Stay tuned. But um, yeah, that's it for today's video. If you liked it, go ahead and hit the like button and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. And if you had some, hit the subscribe button already. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join the Bad Moon family. All right, guys. Well, that's it. And we're out. Say bye, Depos. Say bye. <laughs> All right, guys. We love you. And we'll see you in the future. Bye.